Use code Kick on G Fuel. Use code Kick on G Fuel. Use code Kick on G Fuel to save one person off. Oh, hello everyone, and finally, the level 120 Burkal Super Limit Break build in Dragon Ball. Xenoverse 2. I finally reset my stats and this is what I'm going to be working with until at least they increase the level cap to I'm gonna guess to level 140 or level 150 until it's eventually raised to a level what well, to level 199 or whatever the max level is in the files right now. Basically, this is a stamina build. So max points in stamina, 122 points in basic attacks, and 100 points in strike supers, and then zero in health, zero in key, and zero in key blast supers. Oh, yes. Here's the moveset. No, it's not. That's items. My bad. Here's the moves I'm working with. Future Super Saiyan. It's called my Super Limit Breaker build. Super for Super Saiyan. It's just my standard Spirit Breaker, you know, whatever you want to call it, build. Rather nice. Here's the equipment. Oh, yes. All you need to know is a QQ Bang and the Super Soul. Pause to read there if you want. To make this exact Super Soul. No, it's not. It's a QQ Bang. To make this exact QQ Bang in Xenoverse 2. Mix the DBZ Bardock top with the Beerus top and use a Super Mix Capsule Z as the mixing item and eventually you will get this exact QQ Bang. You could also get this QQ Bang, but instead of neutral point or minus point, we've got, we've got no key skill, so that doesn't matter anyway. You could technically have three plus more positive points or either plus three in health, or what have you. So you can actually do that from that recipe I've just mentioned, but it'll take a lot of work to do. The Super Soul, you get this from a DLC 10 Ultra Pack 2 parallel quest with Android 21. Just go and have a look. I know I'm not showing what the parallel quest is, but you know how to go and look, right? And even if you don't, what you can do is you can actually, I don't know, let me do it for this video whilst I'm waiting for someone to join. Player match limitations off. What am I doing? Uh, go to bag, go to location, look up, go and on Super Souls, and you can see, like, just go here until you find that Super Soul, either the description or the name, and it'll tell you which specific parallel quest you can get that Super Soul from. I'm just trying to think, well, not think, I'm trying to find where it is. You get the general idea, right? Over here somewhere. I should probably go and finish doing these, uh, getting these Super Souls. I didn't know there's quite a few missing. Anyway, that said, do me a favor, leave a like on the video and do subscribe to the channel as we wait for someone to join to show the Super Limit Breaker build at level 120 in Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. Okay, and someone has joined a few minutes later, rather nice. So yeah, there's the build right there. I could also do like a super duper full pale Super Saiyan God build at level 120. Did I do that? I don't know. But here's my main build right now. Now for the creation settings, like when you're making the character, it's max height and I think it's either the second body weight i think it doesn't actually matter it does matter because it just changes the stats but it's not going to be anything major like i don't particularly care i went for what looks best <laughs> also i'm tempted on burkle just burkle to remove the tail if you want to do that do let me know yes tail or no tail in the comments or might put like a comment to vote and then whichever comment has the most uh upvotes i'll do that and if i forget to do that do remind me in the comments okay <laughs> Now he's level 99, unfortunately, so yeah. <laughs> oh, spirit hammer. Awesome <laughs> yeah, so there you go. Uh, that's uh, this is an incredibly powerful build. Granted, it's not the best you could have because I've got you know. Rough Ranger as a counter slash uh, shield skill. Uh, if I can use that later on in the video, I will. But yeah, this is a fantastic build, which is why it's my personal go-to build for when things maybe get real and stuff like that. Moving on, G Fuel flavor of the day. It's the Kamehameha flavor. 
in a can. Try it yourself, cold cack. CAC on checkout to save at least 20% off. Once again, cold cack CAC. I recently did re-sign with G Fuel for six more months. Oh yes, can I get a like on the video for that? Also, by the time this video is uploaded, they should have, and actually it might be in a moment as of me recording this, at like 5 p.m. my time, they should have announced, I think, or they should do at some point soon, announce the uh, new freezer G Fuel uh, and go on one. And I think something else, which I'm not sure if I'm gonna announce it yet. Uh, not, not my stuff, like not my flavor, anything. It's like a new Dragon Ball Z collab them doing. So try that yourself. The wish list should be open. You can't you can't get use cold cack on it, I don't think yet, but it's the wish list for when it is available. Can I get a perfect? Let's see if I can get a perfect win. <laughs> Okay, 2-0. <laughs> That's me playing Flash there, but that's why I do tend to run Rough Ranger. I did used to run Demon Flash Strike for a while, but I just... Rough Ranger is like an OG skill for me, it really is, even though it's like a DLC 6 skill. Oh, oh my for it. Could also make this significantly stronger or better by running, for example, Fake Blast as the Evasive. And I might update it, maybe, I don't know, but yeah, that's uh, the main build as it is right now. Yeah, okay, fair play to the guy, but uh, let's try and fight someone that's maybe a higher level because I'm just absolutely tearing through him because of how strong the build is and the level difference. I mean, he does kind of feel like level 99 compared to level 120. It's kind of unfair, so GG to that guy, 4-0. Let's wait now for the next person to join. I'm checking X. Uh, I don't think they've posted yet about the... Oh, yes, they've just announced it. Okay, good. Oh, yeah, Cold Cack CAC on checkout for the Freezer Saga Collection. Okay, good. Okay, so I was going to say the Super Saiyan uh, flavor, which is lemonade. It's a reskin, so it's a Freezer Collection. It's Evil Emperor for the Fruit Fusion, which is the new, the new flavor. Super Saiyan for lemonade and Ginyu for some pineapple. Oh, no shot. Then bring back the battle juice flavors. Pineapple. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, I, I, I've known about this oh, probably about a year. <laughs> I've just been waiting for them to announce it. Cold Cac CAC. You guys know the deal. Man, this actually looks really good. New uh, berry flavor. Reskin pineapple, which I know is like a really, uh, like it used to be called battle juice, and the super stain lemonade. Fantastic. Okay, so now to join now, Ultra Instinct Sign Goku. Bit of a um, bit surprised. Well, not surprised, it just seems a bit random. I mean, fair enough. <laughs> Level 9, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 
that's why we, we run Rough Ranger. And with this Super Soul and the loot burst the Super Soul has, attack increase, it's just going to do a ton of damage with the Rough Ranger as a counter. Rather nice. Okay, moving on. I love that loading screen, by the way. I think I might actually be permanently done with Breakers. At least, bare minimum, until Season 5. The videos I've done haven't really done well on it. And there is actually, as we recording this, an update for it, like a very small one, which is a PS4 exclusive update or something to fix whatever. To get that artwork, um, I think it's only... Like, go and check the um, the robot... Ro uh, sorry, not robot. Talk to Oolong in, Con in Canton City in uh, Breakers, that little city place, whatever the name of it is called. I'm just going to call it Canton City because it's in Canton City, right? Or right next to it. Uh, get 100 points by clear by finishing 30 matches and winning 15. Does have to be 15 and 30, like separately. That makes sense. Just do it. It doesn't matter if you do 100 fights and then get it. Just do it and you and then back up your data and download it on the same console, and then you will and then look into Xenoverse 2 and then you will get that loading screen in Xenoverse 2. Don't will be back in the future. Oh 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 oh. Oh, 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 if it will, it won't be for a long time because the game's been out now for over a year as of this recording and presumably upload. And the, none of the Breakers, Xenoverse 2 collab loading screens have actually came back yet. So do keep that in mind there. I'm kind of just messed around at this point, I'll be completely honest. <laughs> With this, the uh, attack increase limit burst, this build is even better. It really is. Do you know what? Maybe... Actually, no. We won't go for random character. We'll keep that to the random slop series. Uh, so this video might be a little bit shorter. I don't know. I think it's... I think I've had uh, seven or eight fights. Yeah, until I've had enough or I've got enough for like a video or he leaves. Whichever one comes first, I'll then wrap up the video. So it might be a slightly shorter one just to properly demonstrate this one specific build as of level 120 in Dragon Ball Universe 2. Kaba, sure, why not? Why is Kaba's head so big? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what I was going to say as well is, is that you know what builds good where you can limit burst to both protect yourself like as a knockback and then into like a rough ranger or counter as well as just to get an easy early win you know if you can do both of those things it's a great build <laughs> by the way not that I'm saying it for any reason other than the truth at this point I'm really not taking it too seriously uh, so yeah, I mean, I could have just, I should have moved out the way then when he went for the uh, back hits. I thought, no. Why? <laughs> Why? <Over> Why? <laughs> Again, this is such a versatile build in my. Oh, come on. Why? <laughs> I know I'm sort of spamming Rough Ranger, but I mean, come on.
That's an Awoken. No, it's not. Okay. I cannot wait to see how strong this build eventually can be at level 199 or at whatever the max level eventually will be. And if they, add, like for some reason, I feel like if they do add Ultra Ego and as of this recording, that teaser at the end of the next gen or Ultra Instinct trailer that looks like Ultra Ego Vegeta, we don't know why it is yet. If this Ultra Ego Vegeta, I'm almost certain they'll also add an Ultra Ego Awoken. Given we have Ultra Instinct and Beast, it's like the missing Awoken. Maybe Black Freezer Awoken as well. I don't know. But yeah, um, I, I might sign up because I have a feeling Ultra Ego on this build would actually work much better than Fuji Super Saiyan. But it's just maybe because I, I like Ultra Ego. <laughs> like, I really like it. Probably more than Ultra Instinct. But I have to wait and see. I'll go for a couple more. Or, again, until he leaves and or I get a perfect win. <laughs> So if I remember, that Gohan's Limit Burst should be Stamina and Health Regeneration, I believe. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> oh, come on. Now, you may be wondering why I'm running Future Super Saiyan instead of maybe Super Saiyan for Super Saiyan 2 and even 3 or even Ultra Instinct or any of the God Forms. I just like it as a knockback and the eye takes three bars of key to activate and you can, it's, it's pretty much instant. It might be the fastest Awoken skill in terms of activation, I think. It's either Future Super Saiyan or Potential Unleashed. You could, you could run this build with Potential Unleashed if you wanted to, like outside of using it on a sane character, if you have at least five bars of key as Potential Unleashed. Potential Unleashed takes five bars of key to activate, whereas Future Super Saiyan only takes three bars of key to activate. But if you use Future uh, Potential Unleashed, I think you will get a bigger attack increase, but you don't get the snap vanishing by holding down triangle and you won't be able to warp fully charged beam attacks like Kamehameha, Gadget Gun, Evil Explosion, etc, etc, etc. 
Uh, I just prefer future Super Saiyan. I think Super Saiyan's just cooler than Potential Unleashed, in my opinion. Now, I'll get people in the comments saying, oh, he's got super armor, why isn't he attacking? And I've had a few people, like when I've asked it, when it's been against trash talkers, and they limit burst with super armor, and then they don't attack, like what that guy was doing. I'd have only a handful, maybe not more than four people in total say, oh, it's 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 because it's the honorable thing. Like, that's complete BS. No, it's not. Like, if you want to say that not fighting back with super armor is, is because it's, like, honorable, you wouldn't lose burst in the first place. Like, it's it's just, wow, well, okay, this guy's awful, okay. No offense to the guy, one more, maybe two more. I'm gonna try and get a perfect. Basically, not fighting back when you got super armor, it's because I don't know what I'm doing, rather than, oh, it's a quote-unquote honorable thing to do. Now, if, if you wanna be the honorable thing, and especially with trash talkers, you A, wouldn't trash talk in the first place, and B, you wouldn't limit burst in the second place. Like, it, it doesn't add up, it's just people. I think it's just people watching that are just trying to give an answer rather than what actually makes sense, if that makes sense. Probably no more than three fights left. I do want to try and get a perfect win just to show how fero ferocious this specific build can be. So that said, We'll go for three more fights, or until I get a perfect win. Let's go. You ready for this?
Okay, win, lose, or draw. Final fight now. He's not left, which is good, so I can at least try to get a perfect now. Probably one, because it feels like this guy is getting better after each fight, which could mean that he's, like, reading me and all that, which, if, if that's the case, fair play to him. Uh, but, yeah, win, lose, or draw now. This will be the final fight for this specific video. <laughs> And I am done. Um, I've not lost in the video, so whatever. How many fights I've shown is how many fights I've had. It doesn't matter how many I show anyway, because I've not lost a single one of them. But that is, as of right now, the level 120 male saint. I've just realized for the longest time, I know that this is that this artwork was from the all Green Sync sign Kid Boo battle, but for some reason, I always thought it was on the lookout. Look, I know that's from the series. Doesn't matter. I just realized it's a uh, Kid Boo using, um, what, what, yeah, whatever. Thank you all for watching. That's the build. More videos on the screen right now. I'll see you on one of these other videos on the screen right now in a moment.